Welcome to this Windows 10 channel and today we're going to show you in this tips and tricks video how to upgrade your Windows 10 Home to a Windows 10 Pro for 99 bucks. Now first for people that are wondering I have Windows 10 Home should I go to Windows 10 Pro? If you're just wondering if you should go to Windows 10 Pro you probably don't need to go to Windows 10 Pro. You know what Windows 10 Home and Windows 10 Pro are at the basics exactly the same version of Windows. The only difference is that Windows 10 Pro has features available to people that are like more power users or you know if you are on a network and stuff like that um, you know remote desktop stuff like that and I actually I'm going to show you in the list is going to tell you exactly what it does but you know what? Windows 10 Pro is 199 US dollars usually, which is a very steep price, I think, for a Windows 10 Pro version. But you know what? If you have Windows 10 Home, you've been thinking to get the Pro version. Well, you get it from within your Windows 10 Home for 99 bucks. So you save $100, which is not bad at all. So you go into the notifications at the bottom right. You go into the All Settings and you go into update and security on the left side you will click activation and you'll see your windows activation you'll see that you have windows 10 home in my case but you'll see a button that says go to store if you click here you'll be sent to the microsoft store to get the upgrade for 99 bucks and all you have to do is click on that 99.99 button here now don't go to the store and try to find this it doesn't work you cannot find it at all through the store you have to go through these steps to get that build of windows 10 pro for 99 dollars so it's really cool and here's the difference the difference on the pro version it adds join a domain or azure active directory so it says easily connect to your business or school network. So if you use your computer, for example, to access, um, you know, a school network, a business and so on, then you might need a pro version. That could be something you mean. BitLocker. BitLocker is a nice feature of WinPro. It's the way that it can encrypt data on your computer. So if you have your computer stolen, for example, a business user might want that you'll have all of your data encrypted on your hard drive. Uh, also, you got a remote desktop, so you can sign in and use your PC while at home or on the road. So, for example, you're somewhere else, you can actually log into your PC, have the same screen, see what you're doing. These are nice little features that the Pro version has. Hyper-V, create and run virtual machines in your computer and private catalog access access your company's apps through your own section in the windows store so there's a lot of little features that is interesting in the pro version and actually uh, i will probably be buying this pro version and uh, when i do i'll probably make a video to show you how it works uh, because i've been thinking of uh, going to the pro version for two reasons actually um, I've been thinking of the pro version for the BitLocker feature so that all my files and folders can be encrypted on my computer. And also I've been thinking about the remote desktop possibility. Leave my laptop open at home and use another laptop somewhere else to access information of this laptop. So, and maybe even virtual machines. So that's the deal. 99 bucks. It's really cool. All you have to do is go into, once again, just to let you know, um, notifications, all settings, update and security, activation, go to store, and here's your big $99 button for the Windows 10 Pro. If you enjoy my videos, want to subscribe to my channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, anything you want to know about Windows 10, and even Windows 8, by the way, if you're still using that, uh, why not ask, and we'll try to help you if possible. 
Um, by subscribing, by the way, you'll be notified every time we have new videos and we'll have tons of Windows 10 videos and tons of videos about Windows in the future. So why not, you know, follow us um, and hopefully I'll be able to help you with any problems you might have if possible.